Item number SCP-886. Index Nanny. Object class Safe. Special Containment Procedures SCP-886-A-Alpha and SCP-886-A-03 are to be kept in dedicated humanoid containment suites at Biosite 66 and allowed nutritious rations three times daily. SCP-886-B-2-01 through SCP-886-B-203 are to be kept in containment chamber 886-Delta. Designed as an appropriate climate-controlled indoor paddock on site and provided with appropriate feed. Additional members of SCP-886 may be bred if appropriate reasons for research are presented. If research is not being undertaken, offspring of both SCP-886-A and SCP-886-B are to be destroyed immediately after birth. Description SCP-886 is the collective designation of unique mammals capable of cyclic asexual reproduction. SCP-886-A are identical human females Homo sapiens of Irish descent and SCP-886-B are identical female domestic Irish goats Capra egagrus hircus Members of SCP-886-A and 886-B develop and behave as expected of ordinary individuals of their species and are completely ordinary outside their shared anomaly. SCP-886-A-Alpha is the oldest and presumably original instance of SCP-886-A. SCP-886-A is a human female, age 37, of average intelligence and stature. Once a year during the spring, SCP-886-A-Alpha will spontaneously become pregnant and carry twin instances of SCP-886-B to term. Gestation mirrors that of a standard goat averaging between 140 through 160 days. Instances of SCP-886-B will be female, with white fur and of average size. SCP-886-B are friendly and notably docile, having never displayed any form of aggression towards humans during containment. The milk and meat of SCP-886-B may be consumed safely. The anomaly does not appear to be infectious. At the age of two and a half years, each specimen of SCP-886-B will spontaneously become pregnant, each with a single human infant. Infants born of SCP-886-B are genetically identical to SCP-886-A-Alpha, designated SCP-886-A-XX. SCP-886-A-XX will develop as normal human females until age 15, when they will begin to exhibit the anomaly in the fashion previously described. SCP-886-A-Alpha does not know how or why she began to exhibit her anomaly, only that it began suddenly and without warning. Similarities between SCP-886 and SCP-2910 have been noted, and investigation into whether SCP-2910 is a variant or altered version of the anomaly seen within SCP-886 is currently ongoing. Addendum Recovery of SCP-886 SCP-886-A-Alpha was discovered by embedded agent Donnelly when a local newspaper released a story regarding her anomalous pregnancy in a weekend column. A cover story revealing the column as a piece of short fiction was released, and associated civilians were altered appropriately. A task force was called to the area, and SCP-886-A-Alpha was extracted under the guise of a car accident. Family and friends are being monitored for further anomalies, with special attention paid to the subject's sisters and daughter.